What's up, my Serial Squad? Happy Serial Sunday. Toy Insanity presents Serial Insanity number 89. Been at it a while. And I'm finally going to eat these uh, very expired. They expired July 26, 2019. So they were put in the box a year earlier than that. It's the two Decon exclusive Bear Bricks Funkos. Cereal. Hey kids, remember what I was like in front of the TV on Saturday morning to watch some cartoons and eat your favorite cereal? Funko does bring back Saturday morning cartoon cereals. So these were uh, some of the first that came out. Oh yeah, this is this is the Circle Maze that's been on a lot of their boxes, but modified to be in the Bear Bricks head. Now Bear Bricks are made by Mediacom, Medi Medicom, Medicom, I guess, from Japan. And they were started, this year is their 20th anniversary. When the cereal came out, it was Funko's 20th anniversary. So Funko was started in 98. Medicom was started 2000. And the Funko Pops were started, what, 2010? Anyway, these are very expired. The, the red box has blue cereal. No way. I got ripped and gypped. No way. I knew this was going to happen eventually. Let's double, triple, quadruple check. My red box doesn't have the figure. When I first got these, I thought... I thought the blue box was going to have a red figure... I thought they're gonna have different colored figures, but look. I got these on eBay like a year ago. I can't even um I can't even dispute it at this point. Well, at least one of them had the figure. D Con. Designer Con. 2018. I don't know why they didn't do Freddy Funko. I didn't. I don't know why they didn't do this. Freddy Funko as a bear brick. But at least there's a bear brick. Funko, 20 years of fun. That was 2018. I've always, like, been... What's the word? Not hesitant, not apprehensive. I, I've just never really liked the bear bricks. Because it just... it look, To me, it looks like Disney's Vinylmation... Mixed with, you know, Lego or uh, let's just say Mini Mates, they just never looked that interesting. Ah, oh, that's kind of disappointing because uh, e even today I looked, I literally looked. These are like twenty on twenty twenty five on eBay. I'm trying to see if there's evidence of it being resealed. You know, it could have just been left out from the manufacturer. <sighs> what is the hype of cereal insanity? What is the hype of Funko cereal? They were heavily hyped. 2018. It was the hottest, newest thing. I mean, we... Collected some classic characters. TV shows like Friends, The Office, Golden Girls, classic animation. We did Skeletor, Thundercats, classic video games. We did uh, Pac Man, Sonic. Check the Serial Insanity playlist. We got a bunch of DC characters, they never did Marvel. Batman, Batgirl, Joker, Wonder Woman, Aquaman, Flash. My first Serial Sanity video, probably my favorite pocket pop, was Five Nights at Freddy's. But my point is, my point at this point, 
Funko cereal is done and dusted. It is no more. It don't mean cereal insanity is no more. If there's a cool pop culture related cereal coming to the grocery store, I'm going to get that. I mean, we did the Pokemon cereal. We did the Minecraft cereal. We did the Troll cereal, the Space Jam cereal. Check the playlist. But Funko cereals are no more. It has been one year since the last two came out, which were Stitch, Disney. Oh, yeah, we did all the Disney villains. Hades and Ursula and Cruella Deville. We did uh, Marvin Martian. We did Scooby Doo. We did uh, Huckleberry Hound too. We did Captain Caveman, Hong Kong Fooey. We did Ghostbusters. We did Alien. We did Krampus. We did the Rick and Morty ones. And you notice at some point, I started saying, hey, these Funko cereals, regardless of color, we've literally done black ones, we've done white ones, pink ones, red ones, purple ones, green ones. They come out the same color they go in, let me tell you, check your stool. But I recognized long ago, they taste the same regardless of color. So at some point, I wanted to mix it up, surprise my taste buds, and I started adding beverage pairings. You something cool or creative. We put pickle juice on Pickle Rick. We put eggnog on Krampus. We put Clamato on Ursula. We put green tea on the Green Ranger. I started adding beverages. And today's no exception. To celebrate 20 plus years of Funko hype, 20 years of Metacom Bear Bricks hype, and the death knell in the coffin of Funko cereal hype, because it's all about Funko soda now anyway. You don't even get a soda. You don't even get a soda. You get a vinyl figure in a soda can. Anyway, don't believe the hype. Energy MFP. What is MFP? Maximum fuel something. I don't know. I put monster energy on uh, alien cereal. I put rockstar energy on the kiss Gene Simmons cereal. Anyway. Now I'm putting hype cereal on bare bricks, bareback cereal. Interestingly, the one that had the figure didn't even taste stale. The one with my missing bare brick figure tastes terrible. Is that because of the beverage? I'm going to say no. It just has a funky old mold kind of taste I got these from the same seller on eBay at the time of purchase I honestly thought the figures were different as of today we learned not only the figures the same your boy don't even get a figure in that one zero sanity 89. Thumbs up. Goodbye.